Oh fam, do we have some big freaking announcements. We got a lot of big stuff happening and uh, some cool stuff happening. Don't worry, this truck has been running the last hour and a half so it's warm. But uh, some big news for the 24 valve. Look at that fuel pressure on point. Constant 15 to 20 PSI. So we're gonna be uh, taking this back to the barn here, making some big announcements and uh, making this truck look a lot better than she does right now. What is up everybody and welcome back to another video here on Loud and Proud. If you notice something different, this hat on my head, we do have a whole slew of new items for the store. Now there are all different color variations, different sizes, different options, different logos, different patterns, like all sorts of different stuff for you guys to choose from. And then also, everything from the previous giveaway that we used to sell is now on clearance. So a lot of this stuff, there's a clearance tab on the website and now a lot of stuff is on clearance. T-shirts and hoodies I believe are all $10 off from what they were before. So if you guys are interested in some of the previous hoodies and the previous designs, that stuff is available to you guys at a discounted price, which we hardly ever do. So once it's gone, we are no longer running any more discounts. So just keep that in mind when you head over to the store. Guys, we have a very big announcement for this truck right here today. And now, before I say this, I wanna bring this to your guys' attention and make this very clear as to what these things are for that we do and why we do them, what all it helps with and all that stuff. And just break it down very simple. Back when I had 36,000 subscribers back January 17th of 2018, I said from this point forward we were gonna start doing truck giveaways. And this can do a lot of different things and it is really a good and helpful thing for the channel. Number one thing that it does, A, somebody that's been watching us work on the trucks, watching on the content, leaving the likes, the comments, all that stuff, who spends $15 or more on the website, gets entered to win a truck. This truck is the next giveaway truck. So what that does is it gives the people who support the channel through buying the merch an opportunity to own and drive and get to keep forever and ever, amen, one of the trucks that we have been building. So that's what it does. And another thing that it does, it helps get the other trucks in the channel built. For example, the Longhorn that we built, a few small upgrades to my fiance's truck, but the Nasty Reds transmission, front end parts, um, some stuff on that truck, for example. It also helps get those trucks built and provide content in those other ways. Another thing that it does is it helps provide the next vehicle project, the next build to happen, and to give away the next truck. So those are all the things as to why we do the giveaways and how it is able to help keep new things coming to the channel every month. And on top of those trucks, we also have a big pile of trucks that we keep around, that we drive, that we use. But these trucks come, we get them built in about 30 days, and then we give them away to one of you guys that has been supporting the channel. And it's really a super cool thing. Now what we could do is just say, hey, buy my merch, buy my stuff, whatever, support my channel, and not give anything back. But instead, what we do is we give trucks away, stuff that we love and we appreciate. We give you the exact same opportunity to own one, but just for a lot less than we have into them. So there are the main reasons as to why we do the truck giveaways. And you guys can go spend money on other people's stuff and not get entered to win trucks. But if you guys are gonna be buying our stuff, we want to give you the opportunity to own and drive something that we get to own and drive. So thank you guys so much. Let's get into this video. Big news is out. This truck is the next giveaway truck for the channel. So thank you guys so much for all the love and support with the Duramax giveaway, the previous giveaway. That was our fifth truck that we have given away. This is going to be number six. And this sixth owner and truck winner could be you. So do not miss out, do not procrastinate. Enter to win this truck. I'll tell you some of the stuff that's done, some of the stuff we're gonna be doing, and uh, let you know what you're getting yourself into. So this truck just got a five inch zone lift kit installed. And uh, it looks really good, it rides really good. All it needs is an alignment now. Um, the paint is original. The bed is a Bradford built aluminum bed, so it's never gonna rust, it's never gonna get, um, in that regard, it's never gonna have those issues. Paint's original. It is just a little bit dirty right now, but it is in good, good condition. It does have some ISPRO gauges, so only the best and highest quality for this truck. It's also got the wood grain interior, the six speed NV5600 transmission, it is leather interior, heated seats, AC and heat does work, all the fans and all the vents work, and it is awesome. It also has the radio controls and the volume controls on the back of the steering wheel, which is very nice. It does have the back seat, which by the way, 
is probably never been sat in and it definitely looks it. I do want to give away clean trucks. We don't want to just buy a truck and give it away. And it's very clean and uh, it, it, I mean, it's low miles too. The truck has 142,000 miles. It does have a five inch exhaust, but it has a muffler on it, which honestly, most of the time I'm like, get rid of the mufflers, you know, but this truck still sounds really good, but it's not got any kind of drone in the cab which I like. In terms of the wheels and tires for this truck, we're gonna be putting on some 20 by 12 fuel Triton wheels in the front, the two-tone, the gloss black with the milled accent. That's gonna be what's on the front of the truck with a negative 44 offset. In the rear, we're gonna be running the exact same diameter wheel, which is gonna be a 20 inch with a negative 265 offset off the hub. So um, definitely gonna sit wide. It's gonna look really good, but with this lift kit, the tires do sit in quite a bit and we wanna balance that back out to give it that mean, aggressive look. It's still gonna be able to pull and haul whatever you want it to. However, it's just gonna look good, it's gonna look aggressive, and we're gonna get a nice, high-end, expensive set of wheels and tires on this truck. No, they're not American Forces or anything like that, but trust me, they are not cheap and they are a very quality setup. In terms of tires, we're gonna be running a 35 by 1250 R20 in the rear, and we're gonna be running a 35 by 1350 in the front just to give it that little bit meatier look and it's gonna look really good once it's done and uh, you're about to find out there's the wheels and tires sitting right there and uh, we're gonna be getting those bolted on today Done. Wheels and tires are on. Now for the record, the front dually adapters are still on here. Now, if you guys have ever owned or put wheels and tires on a dually truck, you know that there are these adapters that stick out. It's basically like a two and a half inch or three inch wheel spacer on the front, but they're factory. So they're really freaking heavy duty. I believe they are hub centric. So they're, they're not like a cheap aluminum flat faced, you know, adapter. Um, not that aluminum is bad, but like the flat face non hub centric adapters like cheap junk. I couldn't get them off. Like I tried just with a pry bar, a breaker bar, everything I could and I could not get any of those nuts to break loose. They wouldn't budge. So I just left them on for now and basically it sits like a 14 wide and uh, plus a little bit, a little bit more than 14 wide. So here's what my, my fiance's truck looks like. And that's basically what this thing's sitting like now in the front. However, I'm okay with that look. I like that look. She thinks it looks a little bit overkill. You really mean that? Looks like a tractor. A tractor. She says it looks like a tractor. Well, given that it does have a tractor engine in it, just about, um, it's okay. It's okay. But these are the Fuel Triton wheels, 20 by 12s. We've got a nice meaty. 35 by 1350 Toyo MT. We're not going with cheap tires. And this is something that I don't do on my giveaway trucks and my builds. I don't run cheap tires on them. You know, once you've ran cheap tires, you just know that they wear uneven. They don't last as long. They're just not as durable. Isn't that right, Reagan? Right. Cheap tires don't last the same. But um, so we've got the Toyos on here and these will last a very long time for whoever wins this truck. Which by the way, the giveaway for this truck is live. You guys can now enter to win this beast. We did put in the LED smoked one piece headlights on this thing too, and it looks awesome. The cab lights are already smoked. We just gotta swap out the bulbs with some LEDs, and uh, this thing is just mean and big. 
Look how big this thing is. I mean, it's huge. Five inch lift. 35s, of course, like I've said a couple times now. I mean, the thing is just a monster. I'll show you guys part of the kit up front. Which, by the way, we do have license plates for sale. We do deck our trucks out with those. We got license plates. We got the LMP decals back in stock. Brand new hats. Whole bunch of brand new hats. We've got the black and gold embroidered ones. We've got all different types of options. New hoodies. Yeah, loud and proud diesel trucks. Some Rosine merch, which by the way, if you guys buy the Rosine merch, it <laughs> counts just the same as if you're buying loud and proud merch for the giveaway. So if you guys are diehard Rosine 24V fans, which I know there are some of you guys out there because she's got, well, how many followers do you have in your um, Almost 13,000 followers on her YouTube channel, so clearly you guys like something she's doing over there. If you guys want some Rosine merch, she does have some merch options on her own tab. It's the Rosine tab on the store, and you guys can buy her merch, and that does count as well for these giveaways. So when you buy the merch, everything on the website counts as entries towards this truck. Now, every $15 more you spend gets you another entry to win, and that is how that works. So if you guys are wanting to enter to win a beast of a truck, something that's super rare, super cool, and uh, just low miles, very durable, rust-free, beautiful truck, this is your rig right here. 2002 24 valve. The truck does have head studs. It has a fast 150 lift pump. It's got a South Bend dual disc clutch. It's pro gauges. It's pretty much stock except for preventative maintenance types of deals. 142,000 miles, guys, on an O2 24 valve. That is like, that is hard to find. They should have saw how much attention it was getting when we were driving it in town. Oh yeah. To go wash it. Oh yeah, everybody's just like, just like staring this thing down. Like they just can't get enough of it. It gets crazy. I mean, it gets some looks, guys. We just finished this and it looks really good and the headlights just really topped it off. But um, we've got a bunch more stuff we're gonna be doing to it under the hood. In terms of under the hood though, we're not going to be going insane. We're not gonna be going anything crazy. I'm not gonna tell you everything that we're gonna do, but this truck is going to be set up to run efficient, cool, and basically be like a realistic daily driver usable truck, something that can still haul heavy, something that's not gonna, you know, get hot and overheat or, you know, burn something up. You know what I mean? Like it's gonna run cool and efficient and very reliable. That's the whole goal of the trucks that we do. We build reliable trucks, long lasting trucks, not just tons of horsepower, tons of crap that's half butt done. And then you got, you know, a liability on your hands. These trucks are built right and they're built to last you a very long time. And you could be taking this truck home. We have all new hoodies. Guys, check this stuff out. All new hoodies, all new hats. Where are the new hats? You wanna grab some of the new hats? We got all kinds of new stuff. It look, it's really cool. And hopefully guys, all the shipping should be a lot faster than it's been. We've been doing everything ourselves now, but we moved to a new vendor and now we don't ship them out ourselves. It comes from an actual vendor that manufactures and ships everything for us okay. so that it's all done. So we've got the uh, very simple diesel caps. This is a flat bill. The classic, more fuel, less talk. By the way, these all come in multiple color options. These are not the only color options you can choose from. These are just the ones that I snagged just to test the quality and the fitment of these things. And here, these are gonna blow off. You don't wanna grab them. They're gonna fall all on the ground. I don't want that. But uh, here's the blacked out, loud and proud. It's kind of hard to see, actually. It's trying to, trying to focus. The blacked out, loud and proud, established 2017, which is when the YouTube channel and the loud and proud merch started popping out and the LLC was formed for the business. Um, loud and Proud was established in 2017, so we got that on the hat right there. And uh, of course, the one that I'm wearing right now, which you guys have seen, but the gold embroidered Loud and Proud diesel trucks cap. These hats are very clean, very well fitted. They're adjustable on the backs and uh, just really good stuff. Just really good quality stuff. So anyways, guys, go check it out. All kinds, there's even more hats that I didn't buy just to test the quality, but they are on the website. Whole bunch of stuff. Go check it out. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support, and we will see you in the next video. Peace.